Yo, what's good, everybody? It's your man, Spill Dog, back at you. I was checking out some videos today, and I was looking at Mikey Garcia. Every day, it seemed like it's four or five videos with Mikey Garcia training, Mikey Garcia confident, Mikey Garcia this, Mikey Garcia that, woo-woo. Man, you know, they say, uh... uh a silent man is a dangerous man. Earl Spence ain't saying a word. You know what that mean? That that cat out there training hard, getting right. He going to see what Mikey working with when they had his fight. Uh, I hope Mikey ain't just doing this and getting a fight and, 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 and get walked through like I think he is. And they throw the towel in three, four rounds. Because, uh, I mean, like I said, you know, this ain't like Mikey. He getting out of character. He... he you know, they popping a little bit too much corn over there, you did. And I just, you know, if I was Mikey, I would be humble like he been most of the time. And then if you got, if you know what you say, you know, show it when the fight comes. Now, if he doing this for fight promotion and the, uh, to get more buys for the pay-per-view, then I can understand and I respect it. But he still needs to be careful. Like I say, he popping a lot of corn out here and, uh, it's going to look bad if you come get that ring and Earl just really, really bring you that pressure and you can't handle it because it ain't going to be the same. It's ain't gonna, this ain't Keith Thurman finna get in the ring. This Spence, uh, I think Derek James and Robert Garcia is, two, is probably right now, in my opinion, two of the top five trainers in boxing right now. I'm a big Derek James fan. I, I, that's probably my favorite trainer because of the work that him and Earl Spence do together. I like Bo Mack a lot too, but Bo Mack ain't Terrence Crawford only trainer. And like Terrence Crawford got two, a couple of trainers, a white dude over there that trained him too. So I don't know who actually put in the most work in his camp, but I feel like Derek James, I don't think he could train nobody else the way he trained Crawford. I'm, just, no, I'm sorry, the way he trained Spence. I think it's just a relationship that they developed over the years from him dealing with him for so long. And he just perfected how to train his main guy. <clears throat> I, don't think if he, I don't think he could train. I don't know if he would have had the same success with another fighter that he had with Spence. I'd be watching how they train, and it just seemed like uh, he just got a style that's, that's perfect for his fighter. But, yeah, man, uh, I just hope Mikey, you know, like I say, Mikey real confident out here. I mean, you know, which is good. But I got a funny feeling it's, it, uh, he's selling a dream out here because I, I don't think he think things going to go the way he say. I mean, Earl is just too big. Bottom line, I mean, you know, uh, it's just the bottom line. It, when, when the fight comes, you're going to see. Now, Mikey is a big guy. Now, don't get me wrong, for his size. Mikey was he was bigger than Adrian Broner. He he been bigger than pretty much everybody he fought uh that I've seen. Robert Easter was taller than him, but all the one thirty five pounders and one forty pounders I seen Mikey in when you look at Mikey's body and look at this, he's he, he's much more his body is much more filled out and he looked much more solid than all the guys that he fought at that lower level. So this time we're gonna see what he do. With a with a real big a rick a big solid strong welterweight and see if this snack program and all that do anything for his power and uh his conditioning for down the stretch cause Earl Spence power stay with him throughout the fight. I don't know if Mikey gonna be strong early and weak late, or maybe Mikey thinking he got enough power to catch Earl early and knock him out. That'd be a, I mean it'd be a big surprise, but. He say he see something. I don't know what the hell he see. I know Earl can get hit a lot, but I, the guys Earl been fighting look like they bigger punches than Mikey, and he been eating them like them punches like Skittles. So we gonna see what's up. Uh, but you know, anybody, you know, when you watch the video, if you like it, leave a comment. You know, uh, hit the subscribe button. Till the next one, I'm out.